Hello everyone, this is Amit Dan of AmitDan.com. Today I'll have another episode of Chromebook Tips and Tricks video and I'll talk about how to connect to Wi-Fi on your Chromebook. I'll show you the typical way how to connect it to your Chromebook and then I'll show you a different way uh, which is going to uh, make your life much easier if you follow the simple steps and uh, this is something new which Google implemented and I'm going to show you at the end of this video so let's first start with the you know uh, regular way or the way most common way to connect to uh, Wi-Fi via uh, on your Chromebook so we have a Chromebook right here and this is not connected as you can see right here that is not connected so the first thing you're going to be doing is uh, hit the time or clock section on the lower right corner of your Chromebook so let's click here and then you're going to get this uh, menu or section and here you're going to see that you know a few options and one of them is Wi-Fi which is right here and then it says here not connected so let me bring this a little closer so you can see that you know here it says not connected so that means that right now you're not connected to Wi-Fi so I'm going to just click on it so once you click on it and it has to be on the Wi-Fi button which is on right here but let me just turn it off just to show you how you, what it looks like so once it's off then you're not going to see any available networks right here so that means that you know this is off so you want to turn this on and once you turn it on then it's going to show you all the networks and definitely like you know, if you live in a building or in an apartment or condo then probably you're going to see like you know many other uh, Wi-Fi networks from your neighbors so you have to just pick the one which is you know related to your network or which is your own network so right now you can see that you know uh, the first one and the third one is my network so internet entrepreneur 2.4 gigahertz and 5 so I'm going to go to the 5 one and if I click on it then you can see that you know this is asking you to enter your password uh, so I'm going to just you know enter the password once you hit the enter the password just hit connect and right now you can see here that's it it's connected so for example if I click on here then you can see that it's connected and it's even telling you that this is a strong this is a very strong internet so just in order to test it so if you open up a browser then you can see that you know internet is working so this is the typical way to connect to internet on your Chromebook now I'm going to show you a different way uh, this is a new implementation so basically what it does that you know you can sync all your devices across the board and you have to be connected on one device and then it just you know gets the information uh, Google or Android system uh, gets the information from other devices and in order to make this active so what you have to do just go back to the internet section and then hit here and then just you know hit one of these here and now you can see that you know it's bringing you to a separate page and then once you are here so you're going to hit people which is right here so once you hit connected people then you're going to see a section and one of the options is going to be sync and google services so if you click on this tiny arrow button okay then here is going to give you a few options to sync everything so basically for example you can see that you know manage what you can sync uh, review your sync data then like you know enhance the spell check so here lots of options we're going to click on here manage what you sync and if you click on here then you can see that you know here you have options to what you want to sync so for example sync everything or customize sync and one of the option is going to be Wi-Fi network this option turned on because I synced I chose here so this option turned on right now because I chose here sync everything so what it means that my Wi-Fi network is now being synced with my other devices which have uh, 
Google operating system. So that way you don't have to enter a password for everything. And one device can use the password and ID from other devices. So this is another way to connect to your uh, connect to your network. If you have more than one, uh, you know, Google devices or devices which have the same operating system or works with Google account. And then you can sync your Wi-Fi networks across the across all devices and you don't have to like you know go through the internet uh, uh, Wi-Fi connection which I showed you so that's another way and this is something new uh, which uh, Google just uh, implemented so that's all for today thank you for watching this video forget about subscribing this channel forget about liking this video there'll be more videos coming up so I'll see you shortly thank you